Visual cues are extremely important to both, you know, cooperative formation flying and, you know, any kind of air combat. One of the things that I was talking about yesterday, and we alluded to this earlier, was when I'm in, for instance, tactical formation in a T-38 or an Eagle, you know, one of the things that we talk about, we use all, all visual cues on the other aircraft. I shouldn't say all, but a lot of visual cues on the other aircraft to determine what my distance is, you know. Can I read the the markings on the tail, you know? Can I read the tail code or the or the serial number can i make out its camouflage or does the airplane just look sort of generally hazy gray can i make out the canopy and the cockpit as a separate portion of the aircraft or does it all sort of blend in my personal sort of max distance i guess that i've uh, i could regularly not just you know on any one given day uh, see was somewhere around the 15 mile uh, perspective and that was even aided. So in other words, that was looking through the HUD with a, a green target designation container with a radar lock. So not only did I know physically in the HUD where to be looking, but I knew sort of what distance that was at. And, uh, you know, with the giant uh, wings of Rodan and the uh, Eagle, you know, when they would show me a belly or a wing flash or something like that, I, I, could, I could see them and, and maintain the tally as a bandit that distance out. Is that, you know, realistic for other aircraft? I don't, I don't know that I could do that with a Viper. It's a much smaller aircraft. I don't know that I could do that with something like a MiG-21 or maybe even a MiG-29, but you know, I, I could do that with an Eagle.